Hello, everyone. I am so, I am so stoked for this video because, hold on, let me show you this. That's right, we got, so this isn't just the fifth anniversary set, this is the premium edition fifth anniversary set that you could only order from Premium Bandai, which if you are a fan of Dragon Ball, Digimon, Gundam, um, I highly recommend checking it out. I ordered this back in, oh my goodness, March, I think? I've been waiting so long for this and like, oh goodness. Okay, so like, first of all, you get your you get your fifth anniversary box and I think I think this premium edition one is like different from what you would buy in store but you also get this guy right here oh he's not gonna fit on screen I'm gonna have to get like b-roll footage of this cuz I'll put it up you should be looking at it right now but like oh my goodness it's super high quality too oh my gosh this is so nice this is like really nice really puts the uh really puts the premium in premium bandai um and then we're gonna get into this and i love this look at like look at like they put so much care into the packaging like just just the packaging premium bandai is cool like they 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 like they show you that they give a crap like it's like vacuum sealed oh my god and the artwork on this hold on let me get this out and then i'm gonna show you guys the artwork without like all of the reflection from the plastic. This is crazy. It really does feel like when you buy something from Premium Bandai, like I've gotten a bunch of Digimon stuff from them before, it really does feel like premium, quote unquote. Like you feel, you feel special. Okay, cool. And look at that, oh my God, it's like lifted gold foil on there. I mean, it's not lifted, but it's like, it's gold foil for sure. And you got that like shiny, like fifth anniversary set. Got Broly on here. Got my boy Fusamasu. Oh man, this is so nice. And then you got like Shinron here. I can't wait to start just like putting cards into this. This is so, this is so, it's beautiful, honestly. Okay. Oh man. Okay, so first we get, ooh, new card sleeves. Oh, those are nice. Those are like really nice. I can't, hold on, let me see if I can't grab one of these lights so you guys can kind of like see that better. It's got the purple, Vegeta, the blue, hold on. There we go, that's better. That's so cool. I wonder like, hold on, I wanna pull these out because I wanna know what the quality is like. Ooh, that's a good sign, that color right there. I think these are the, the card sleeves that I like. They're, um, what's it called? I can't remember the material, but, oh yes. These are actually, hmm, I'm gonna have to compare. I think these are a little bit different from, um, I was like kind of referring to the ones in like Ultimate Box, but these are good. These are very high quality. They're not like as thick and like slippery. <laughs> I don't know if that's the right word, but we are definitely keeping these and we're gonna be putting some cards in here. So, okay. We're gonna go right down the line here. What is this? Oh, do, oh, this is never, this is never coming out of this packaging. Hold up. This is so beautiful. I need good lighting on this so that I can show you guys. Look at how beautiful that is. That is just, that is just beautiful. That is just so cool. Hold on. Let me see, can I get it to like focus? There we go. What? There's so much gold foil and you get, oh my God, hold on, there's another one in there? There's three. There's, oh man, no, I really don't want to open this. I really want it to stay in here forever, but there's three cards in here. And I do run an unboxing channel. Okay, all right, dang it. I thought it was gonna be like multiples. Oh, gotta be so careful with these. Gotta be so careful with these. Hold on, let me get the card sleeves. Let me get these card sleeves because they are going immediately into card sleeves. It looks like there are three of them. So I'm gonna get three. What are these cards that you get? So you got Super Saiyan 4, so Hyper Evolution, 
Super Saiyan Goku. Hold on. Okay, so Hyper Evolution Super Saiyan Goku. <gasps> Broly, ultimate agent of destruction. That is like, oh man, I wish. What is with the lighting right now? I wonder if it's just like my camera picking up on the back lighting. That is like so cool. And then you got Baby Hatchack. Hey, that's the dude from, um, But oh my goodness, these are like so cool. I'm still gonna like take pictures and get some like cool looking B-roll footage so you guys can really see. There's so much texture. There is so much texture on this foil and there's so much foil, oh my goodness. Really like going all out for the fifth anniversary. I don't know if these are like good cards, if they're playable in the meta or whatever. I do know, however, so we got two packs of these here. So it looks like these are gonna be all foil and these are gonna not be foil. It looks like these are gonna be like commons and uncommons. And then these are EX cards, which I can't remember what EX stands for. Hold on. Like I can't remember exactly what EX stands for, but let's just go get into this. So these, these two packs of cards right here, these are gonna be, if you're like into deck building or whatever, if I'm remembering correctly, these are gonna be like staple cards that are very important for deck building. So like these are cards that I think they saw a lot of play and then you get, like you see, you get like duplicates, right? So Pilaf, got two of those, Android, Super Saiyan, Rose, Majin Buu, Bulma fighting for Vegeta. <laughs> Love it. Frieza before the fall. Captain Ginyu. So yeah, no matter like what deck you play, you have like the um the cards that you need. Sun Gohan. Now here's the thing, I don't really play Dragon Ball. I I really only collect. Oh hey, and then this is the uh like super special card that we just got. So hold on, do you get like the other ones too? I I wasn't paying attention. Masked Saiyan, Belligerent Warrior, Chilled, Ruling Through Fear, Piccolo and then sell. Wait, so hold on. Did we get that Super Saiyan 4 Goku in here as well? I don't think we did, or that Brawly? Unless it's like a different artwork and I missed it. Huh, I don't know. Interesting. Interesting. And then let's go look through these guys real quick because these are also going to be some staple cards for like deck building if I remember. So we got... Oh, do we not get duplicates of these? These are all just like you get one-offs? I wonder why that is. Broly. Oh, oh, get some cool leader cards here. So I guess these specifically are like... Really good leader cards. Got some more Dark Broly. I did wanna, I was thinking about like a Dark Broly deck. Again, I gotta actually get into playing the game. Hey, I have this in a box topper. <laughs> oh, wow. Then you got Videl. I don't know anyone who plays a Videl deck. I haven't seen a Videl deck. Ultimate Dark Dragon Saiyan Bullet? Huh, interesting. Universe 6, Assemble, Kaioken, Kaioken, Training Goals, King Kai, King Kai, and then a Deborah Leader card. What is, Vegex? Vigex? Fusion Hero? Vegeta and Trunks? Oh, I didn't, what? I didn't know that was a thing. Vegeta and Trunks Fusion. 
Super Saiyan God Goku. Oh man, that's awesome. I did see a lot of Super Saiyan God decks being played. Um, somewhere, somewhere, I can't remember where. It was like some kind of like Swiss regionals thing. Oh man, that's awesome. That's crazy though that you only get like one of each. I wonder why. I mean, I know, I know Dragon Ball, the Dragon Ball card game is all about collecting, you know? So maybe they're trying to get you to like buy multiples, but I mean, I definitely cannot buy multiples of this. And then let's get these guys. Now this, this, oh man, these boosters right here. This is, oh man, these are gonna be like reprints of like, like rare cards, good cards. Oh my God, this pack, she thick, so thick. And then I think, yep, they're all, they're all holographic. Let's see here, we got Hit, SS, so we got some Zenkai cards here, a lot of Zenkai cards here. Majin Buu, Ultra Instinct, ooh, Janemba. Oh wait. It says Awaken. Oh, it's a it's a Zenkai card. Duh. And then we got Vegito. Are these all Zenkais, I think? I think they're all Zenkais. And then Toa. Oh my god, these are so cool. These are so awesome. I wonder if I should just put these all in sleeves too. I might actually. I might do that. And then let's Open this last one here. Dude. What kind of cards am I going to store in here? Like which Dragon Ball cards? Cause that's the other thing too, is like this is meant for storage. And then, okay, so we got some other Zenkai cards. We got Wheeze, Frieza, got another Hit, Broly. Yeah, it looks like these are all Zenkai cards. And I'm assuming they're gonna be good ones, useful ones. So it looks like we got two packs that were like almost identical, almost, but like not fully. This is awesome. Wow, I love this. This is honestly, like I think this was worth the money, this was worth the wait, because I, I ordered this back in like March, if I'm remembering right. I ordered this back in like March. And I will say it was definitely worth the wait. Um, I loved this. This is so awesome. I think there are still some like fifth anniversary sets out there, but not the like premium Bandai one. Um, I'm actually not sure what the difference is between the premium Bandai version and like the um, the premium Bandai version and like the uh, what do you call it? The regular version. Because I know there was like a regular fifth anniversary set. Hold on, I want to put these back in here. That's what I want to do. I think that's how I'm going to store these. And then I am going to put like some other cards in here. I have like some of the other boxes from like way back when. And I use like, I use one for like all of my leader cards so that it's like really easy to find a particular leader whenever I do finally get into deck building and whatnot. Don't know when that'll be, but I definitely know I'm gonna be playing the uh, online client. And I love the idea of like playing you guys on this channel if that, uh, if that client ever drops. I am looking into doing like a TCG video game channel. So, but I don't know. I feel like I would also have some like Dragon Ball card game online content on this channel as well. But let me just put you guys back. Nice and neat. There we go. Put you in there. Put these card sleeves in there. I mean, no, I'm definitely gonna put all of these in card sleeves, but I'm not gonna make you guys watch that. Anyway, pretty short video, but thank you guys so much for watching. Um, it means a lot. We're almost at 500 subs now. I think we might actually be pretty close to 500 subs once this video goes out. Um, 
definitely looking at doing a bunch of different stuff for this channel moving forward. I know uh, Brandon Bell, MMA fighter, Brandon Bell, if you guys haven't checked him out, he's got a TCG channel. He's been asking me to do some kind of like breakdowns of like Dragon Ball Z cards and like deck building and whatnot, some rules and whatnot. But I, like I said, I, I gotta like play a bit more because I've only ever been collecting these. Um, so I need to do that. And we are looking at putting out some more One Piece content. I think I actually have, as I'm filming this video, the first like One Piece booster box in my mailbox right now. And I gotta go grab that. So we're looking at more One Piece content, some like Pokemon content here and there, probably. And then of course, some new Digimon stuff. Um, I know the last month of this year, we're like halfway through December now. It's like all, it's like all Dragon Ball content. So. Dragon Ball fans, eat it up. Um, anyway, if you're new to the channel and you've gotten this far in the video, be sure to like and subscribe. Um, I really appreciate it. We're growing pretty quick here, and uh, I'm proud of that. But anyway, I will check you guys next time. Um, thank you so much for watching. Peace.